Welcome back to this uh, channel. This is uh, AutoCAD for Engineering. This is lesson number 36. In this lesson, we'll uh, continue to talk about the uh, 3D modeling. And uh, today, we'll focus on uh, the two commands, the box and cylinder commands. We'll start with the first one, the box. So when I use the box, I just come here, and then activate the command. Once the command is activated, it will ask me to specify the first corner or the center. We just start with the, the first corner. Click the first corner and then go to, to the length and then the width. Click. Now ask me to specify the height to so just go up and then click. Done. But I can see because it's a box, I just see like in the 2D vision. To change this, because here says unsaved view, come here, and then go to the surface isometric. If I click, now I can see that I can see in uh, the 3D. But I can also change here with the shaded from the 2D wireframe to the shaded. Come here and then click. Now I can, I can see a very good view. You can ro rotate and then you can see that this is the box. I have also. Uh, have another option to make this box just go there click and then make the using the center just come here and then click the center come here and then click now you can specify whether the length and the width so in this in this one i will just use the first one which is uh, uh, let's see five and then type tab and then put four depend and then enter now specify the height, just go to the height, will be here, let's see, three, and then enter. You can see that uh, I have also make the box in the center of another box. I can change the color of this box, just come here, double click. Now the layers by default is white, I can change with another color I want. I can just put here like red or green, done. And then uh, I can make another one. So we make the, the, the box using the points. Now we can also make the box using the, the cube. Just come here to the cube, click, and then we can just make the, the cube in a direction, also in an angle. I'll just put here the angle like, let's see, 90 degree. I mean, uh, 90 degree, enter. So that's my box in a 90 degree. So you can see here is to be right. Okay, we'll just go back and then make again another one. So this is it. I just come here, click, first point, second point, done, up, and then done. Change the color, double click, and then you can change the color you want. Put this one here, you just come here and then put like yellow. So I can also make another one with the, the same height. So this is, is, is so simple. Just come here, click, specify the, the, the point, first point, second point, the height. I, I want to be like in this height, just come here, put cursor, don't click and then move to this side, right? And then click. So now they have the same height. Now, I can also make the, the box using the, the two points. So I'll just use like this one here, the first point, and this one here is second point, and then go up. So that's the way we can make the box. So that's, we can use whether center or the point, and then we need to specify. If we click to the center, or I'll just use this one here, the center, click, and then specify the points and also the width if you if you know the dimension just go there and then put the dimension like one and then to go to the, to the width type tab and then put like let's see two or 1.5 and then enter now the height like this one here then click done so that's the way we make the box let's talk about the the, the cylinder to make the cylinder is like the same thing, we can ju just come here and then change with the cylinder. 
click cylinder now it is activated now I can make the cylinder just uh, type the first one now same thing specify the base point click and then specify the height just click so change the color again same thing by the default is white come here and then put the color you want so just put green or blue in center and so on and then type ESK in your keyboard now we can also make the, the cylinder using two point first come here click the two point this is the first point and this is the second point like in the center of this one here and then just go up or down so I can also change uh, and I make the cylinder using different uh, like points let's just put here another drawing just quickly now I will make this, the cylinder using two points come here and then uh, ask me to specify the center point or I will just come here click using three point click there and then this is first point second point and then here is the third point just come here click and then move the the, the height now I can also like we we'll just put here first the height this one here and then change the color come here and then go green this time I can also make the, the cylinder in any direction so now we're just using uh, up or down you can also use in uh, any other axis to make this one here the first point second point going up now I can change to change just come here axis end point click there now you can see you can change the direction if you if you if you know the angle we just put here like uh, let's put seven and then go tab to the angle 60 degree enter so that's the way we do we can also move up by going like that then click oh then go down click then enter just move to this sides a little bit you can also change the position of the drawing we can also make the, the drawing uh, the cylinder using the tangent come here click in tangent but before doing that we'll just deactivate the commands and then change here the color by default we we'll just put here white okay uh, now we can uh, activate the command then come here to tangent click tangent and then go to the tangent you can see here this is tangent here so when I come here right it show up even also here it will show up the tangent you can see okay that's tangent here first and then here second point now specify the height specify the radius so just put here like one enter now you can go up or down we just put it here down and then click so i make the cylinder using the tangent of this cylinder and this one here so right at the edge just change here this color double click here to change the color for this one to have a good understanding right so we can also make the cylinder using click and then using elliptical just come here click and then now here you you have to specify the point second point right and then you can move right so this is like elliptical and then go up and down just go up you can see here the elliptical cylinder in a different uh, angle so pretty much that's that's the way we have to make the cylinder in a different ways specify the end point and then specify the the axis just you like that and then go up and then you can change the color i hope you you like the, the videos please don't forget to subscribe and help uh, this channel 
So see you to the next one.